In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add a post to a menu inside WordPress. This is part of my WordPress skills playlist. It's linked in the description down below. So if you find this video helpful, that playlist is going to be super helpful. So check that out. If you have any questions or comments about this video, please leave them down below. I try to answer them the best I can. My name is Bjorn Allpass in WP Learning Lab. We will help you get better at WordPress so you can earn more for yourself, for your customers, and for your business. And if you haven't done so yet, click subscribe and ring the bell so you don't miss new future videos. And now let's get started. Our navigation menu is right up here. We currently have the blog archive page and a shop page in the menu. Shop is a drop down and two categories, healthy eating category and the exercise category linked to up there as well. If you want to learn how to add categories to your menu, check the card up above and the description down below to see a video on that. In this tutorial, we're going to add a post to this menu. So let's go back into the dashboard and then go to appearance and menus. We first have to make sure we're on the correct menu by selecting from the drop down here. What the menu looks like, what it has in it will appear down here. So you can tell if you're in the right one or not. This is the correct menu that we had earlier. If it wasn't, we'd select the other one, then click on select, and that will update this area to the correct menu. Let's go back to our blog navigation. And now we can add posts. In fact, we can add lots of things. On the left-hand side here, we can see all the things we can add. We can add pages posts, products. If you have WooCommerce, you can add products, custom links, categories. If you have WooCommerce, you can also add product categories, product tags, and WooCommerce endpoints. Other plugins and themes will allow you to add other stuff as well, depending on what you have on your site. We want to add posts for this tutorial. As long as the post is created, we can just check the box, click on add to menu, and that will add the post to the menu. And we can rearrange it, we can move it right to the front or right here. Just click and hold and drag and it'll move everything around. And if you indent it, it will become a sub item of, of whatever the parent item is. The thing with posts that you're not going to encounter with pages usually or categories is the title can be a lot longer than what you want to have in a menu. To change that, click on the down arrow and we can actually change the text of the title from post workout smoothie to just smoothie if we wanted to. First, I'm just going to have post workout smoothie. I'm going to show you how this looks. Click on save menu to make this menu change. And then let's visit the site again. And we see post workout smoothie as a drop down from healthy eating. If you don't want it as a drop down, just move it out so it's in line with all the parent items. Click on save menu again. And then come out here and refresh. Now we have our post workout smoothie. And if you're finding this tutorial helpful, click the like button because that helps this video show up for more people on YouTube so we can spread the knowledge and help more people with this information. So make sure you click like if you like this video. And maybe post workout smoothie is too long. We don't want that much text for that menu item. Click on the down arrow for the post. Let's have it be just smoothie. Whatever you type in here is going to be the label for that link. Then click on save menu and then refresh and now it's just smoothie, but it goes to the exact same place. If I click on it, it goes to our post workout smoothie post, which we see right here. So that's one way to add posts to menus. Another way is if we're in the WordPress dashboard, we go to appearance and then customize. This will take us into what's called the customizer. And in here we can click on menus. We pick the appropriate menu we want to change. In this case, blog navigation. Here it shows all the items in the menu. We can remove them just by clicking the drop down, clicking on remove. We can also do this in the other menu area we saw earlier. So let's just remove the smoothie one. It updates in real time on the right on the preview area. Let's click on add items and we can add other posts. Let's add this one right here. Maintaining well-being through stressful times. And that one's very long. A couple posts like that and you're running out of space. So let's change the name of this to well-being. Nice and short. And let's rearrange this so it's after healthy eating. And then publish if we're happy with what we see here. Anything we do in here, any edits we make, they're not actually saved to the live site until we click on publish. Now that one is published and we have that new link right here. And it takes us to the maintaining well-being blog post right here. If you found this video helpful, you're definitely gonna wanna check out this playlist right here. It's the WordPress basic skills playlist on my YouTube channel. 
it'll answer lots and lots of WordPress questions for you. So make sure you check that out. And if you haven't done so yet, click subscribe and ring the bell so you don't miss any future videos. My name is Bjorn Allpass in WP Learning Lab. Till next time, keep crushing it, and I will see you in the next video.